Barber shops have come and gone, but Paul Mole has withstood the test of time of 93 years. Let's go upstairs and find out why. Adrian, who is the owner of this beautiful barber shop, and tell me, this has been open for 93 years? It's been open every day since 1913, and we close Christmas Day and July the 4th, and we're open for 12 hours a day. 12 hours a day, uh -huh. seven days seven a week. Seven days a week. What makes this place so special? Why has it been able to stay a staple in New York? I think it's the area, you know, the area is this silk stocking area that people require. Um, good service and that's what we offer them. And what kind of service is that? We work by appointment, we work right on time, we uh, make sure everything is very clean, we work a sterile operation, we have the best barbers and uh, we try and offer a, a good, uh, good honest service. And I was noticing all of these mugs around. Mm -hmm. Tell me about how, how long do you have to be here to be able to get one of those? 20 years. 20 and, years. Yeah, and we have 5,000 of them and uh, we can't even put them all up and people come in and they look for their mug and they decide, you know, where they want to be in the shop. You know, we get Mike right. Wallace and Dan Rather and the Donald comes in here and uh, he just came in a, a couple of months ago with his apprentices and he did a little segment in the shop. Well, those little seats downstairs are probably from about 1850 and uh, they were made in Brooklyn and uh, they're really good uh, chairs for cutting kids hair in and they're uh, they're now quite quite uh, expensive you know because everybody wants them as collector's items but we use them as everyday uh, we use them as everyday tools they're not props we use them and he has a, a towel on him over here. What's yeah, going on? He's got a hot towel, moisturizing his face. And what's the next step after the towel? Do you leave that on for a certain yeah, amount of time? Yeah, we're going to leave it on for a few minutes and then a little shaving cream and another hot towel, a little more hot lather, and then we'll, uh, we'll shave it. Okay, now what is this? It's a little uh, facial massage. A nice no, aftershave moisturizer. So how much does it cost to get a haircut? It costs uh, twenty nine dollars. And you have to have an appointment. Make, you make an appointment. You don't wait. You just walk right in. Your barber's waiting for you. And we'll get you out as quick as you want. If you want to spend a half an hour, we take a half an hour. If you want to spend five minutes, we'll take five minutes. Men feel comfortable coming to the barber shop. You can come in here, get a shave, get a haircut. Nobody's going to question, you know, the services you get. It's a man's place, and you can come be a man, and you can talk politics, or you can, you can talk about anything in a barber shop. So it's a guy's place. It's a guy's place. On the Upper East Side, Paul Mole is a place that services everyone from toddlers to adults. I liked it so much, I'm going to bring my dad here. <laughs>